what's going on facebook i mean actually youtube instagram why did i say facebook well i'm gonna let you guys know why did i quit mca so facebook already knew about this i posted it on facebook but i never made a video about it or anything for youtube or instagram so here it is i'm just letting you know why so I'll say about a year and a half ago, maybe, maybe a little bit more. I don't know. Um, I actually uh, started Forex. I started it out with Elite Trading Academy, though, which which no longer exists now. Elite Trading Academy died as of January, which I, I'll admit I saw coming, but it was it was a good start. It was an entry point for me to learn how to start trading. And grow my income. <clears throat> so I jumped in, and I saw too much, more, way more opportunity in that compared to marketing, recruiting people, chasing a commission. I mean, MCA it's good. There's nothing if you like MCA and you want to trade forex or something after two. There's nothing wrong with having an extra stream of income, but for me, I got to a point that it just turned into, what's the point? I mean, it's not my forever, and I just don't see that network marketing as, a, well, with MCA at least, a great long-term income. If you want a great long-term income and more money, you want to actually invest or get a legit business. Well, MCA is still business, but it's not your own business. And who knows when they're actually going to change things and actually add more restrictions to like the way you're marketing. I feel like they're, yes, they're starting to crack down on the people who actually aren't marketing correctly, flashing money not even really branding themselves or the business or s selling the products i mean i'll admit a lot of people they they really don't sell the products and that really just makes the business look bad especially when you're just flashing money and saying stupid junk like oh flip 40 into thousands um you're going to get paid by next week because in all honesty that's not the case. That's just the way to reel you in. People are just trying to pitch you. I've never had to say that to get paid. You should never have to say some stupid crap like that just to get paid. I personally, I told all my students to not say that. Go against that. Dudes, you want to brand yourself. You want to show people that you're a leader. Not to mention you want to build a really good audience and then show people what the opportunity can do for them personally that's how you get the right the right um customers the right business people to work with and you want to actually throw out the benefits at some point let people know that the company has great benefits personally i'll admit i'm not doing this anymore but i kept my benefits I still enjoy those. I mean, if I get a ticket or something, I could always have them send a lawyer and fight that ticket for me or something. If I get stopped or lose lose a tire or something like that happens, my car breaks down, I'm still covered. I got all these benefits for a really good deal. I'm not complaining. <laughs> but at the end of the day, I wanted more money than what I was making. And Forex granted me that opportunity. I mean, you can pitch people all day if you want to chase people down. Well, with the way I market, you really marketed. You really even didn't have to chase people down. You, I, I really had people coming to me. Like even now, like I, a lot of people look at my YouTube videos. They they message me, hey, I want to join MCA. But personally, a lot of people who even join. It takes them longer than most to actually get it. And I know this because I've actually started from the bottom. I started, I didn't have many friends on my friends list at all. I started with like 200 friends. 
that's when I learned I needed an audience. You could post all day, but without an audience, without those eyes, how are you going to sell a thing? And that was the dilemma for a lot of people who actually joined. I mean, some people who joined me, they made money, but there was always that little bit who didn't have that or the patience. Some people, they didn't even want to study or anything, and they just quit just because I had so much to teach. So the success with it, it, it really just depended on the person. I'll admit it's the same with Forex, but there's I admit there has been less of that because you don't have to go through teaching people how to sell, market, and all this extra stuff. It's really just go through the training and then just practice, practice, practice on a demo account. Get consistent on your own and just get the full understanding. It's, I just feel overall it was less of a hassle with Forex. Investing, and not to mention it's more time friendly for for parents, for people who work all the time, go to school. You just have to be willing to actually do it. MCA, yes, it's possible to manage the time, but it, you're still getting less money. It's more of a hassle. Especially when you're building yourself up. Because this is the brand that you're actually building. An overall brand for yourself. But with Forex, you, you don't have to work with people like that. I mean, eventually down the road when you build that skill, you can do that. But overall, you build yourself up. You build your own knowledge. And you can make a killing doing it. Just for what? Trading currency? You just need... Like MCA, yes, you just need your phone, computer to do it. But overall, you can make more for less work. Just build on what you know. Get, get the good mentor. Get the good training. And just stay on top of it. I'll admit, though, if you're not willing to learn, you won't earn. Same concept with MCA, but in this case, this one... It, you can you will lose money if you do not put in that time and rush things. That's why I, I recommend people start off on demo. I recommend people go through my training. If you're not willing to do all that, don't expect anything. But for those that already joined MCA or, or may be looking for help that want some type of training... All you got to do is click the link in the description and then just ask me for my training and then we can talk. And then um, if you want to learn more about Forex, you're, you're also welcome to click the link in the description, add me on Facebook, and then ask me about how to get started or training or whatever. I mean, I'm, I'm here to help people. That's overall what, it, what this online marketing was about. That's what Forex is about for me. I mean, now it's more independent for me, but now you got, I got extra ways to help people make more money. Elite Trading Academy, I'll admit, that one is also dead too. <laughs> I am not a part of any MLM. I'm not joining another MLM because personally, all those MLMs, you're only going to learn the basics anyways. I had to advance on what I know on my own time get a, get a few extra mentors to fully grasp that concept that um to on how to trade uh, how to do price action all this extra stuff but <laughs> I got it I mean whether it's short trading long term trading I got it and especially if you are long-term trading, that's going to be more convenient for you. Especially if you're a student, if you are working, you're a parent, it's going to help you more. Cause, because you get into the trade, you let that shit run, and all you do is just manage it with your phone. Just plug it in with your computer, manage it with your phone. Good. Get paid. <laughs>
But um, like I said, if you want any MCA training, you can click the link in the description. If you want to learn more about Forex or learn more about how to get into my training, which I'm, I'm still developing, all you got to do is just click the link in the description and we'll be good to go. Um, if you have any questions, also feel free to comment below and let me know what your questions are. And then please like this video and subscribe.